Well, there's several things I like about the United Methodist Church. Uh, first, I think we have really good theology. I think we care about the Word, we study the Word, and, and uh, we apply the Word as best we can. So to me, the, the fact that we're really strong in our, in our Bible theology, I, I think is very important to me. My hopes and dreams uh, for United Methodist Church right now probably are, um, first, uh, that we get over our fear. Um, I think fear is causing us to direct too much of our best energy uh, away from the gospel into protecting the institutions that we all cherish and are important, uh, but since we're so afraid, uh, we're not focusing on the things that make those institutions important, that, that being spreading the gospel. We're all wrestling right now, of course, with how do we even just connect with people that are difficult to connect to right now? Uh, for example, I, I have a challenge right now because one of my ministries, Community Night, um, I didn't have contact information for the people that typically came to that. And so I actually don't have any way to get in touch with them. And so I've been working with, how do I, how do I figure out how to get in touch with people that know I'm probably out there, know I'm trying to get in touch with them, but, but I can't. So I think part of it is uh, wrestling with that, how do we find them? Uh, and then secondarily, it's helping people to get comfortable with reaching out when they can't go and knock on their neighbor's door, when they can't borrow a cup of sugar. Uh, and, and how do they be comfortable with uh, sharing their hearts on email or on text or on Twitter. A lot of our younger people, I think, they've already got it. We, we really, um, the main thing we need to do with the younger people is support them and get out of their way. Uh, but with the older people, we need to help them figure out how to do that.